Hi, I'd like to take a few minutes and share with you the state of real estate for 2012 in Port Townsend and Jefferson County. We're located on the Olympic Peninsula in the northwest corner of Washington State. Um, I want to just share with you some of uh, the specifics of what's happening in real estate and then also share with you my predictions for 2012. Uh, I'm with Remax First in Port Townsend. I'm the designated broker and uh, here's my thoughts. I want to start out by saying that uh, um, typically this information has come from uh, my trips to the National Realtor Conventions. I try to go every year and always good um, statistical information as well as workshops. But uh, basically the real estate market has been a four-year cycle uh, for this current economic condition. And um, if you look at the hard-hit states like Arizona, Nevada, uh, Florida, Michigan, um, they have started to see some recovery. As a matter of fact, we've actually started to see, th those states have actually started to see some slight appreciation in prices. Now for the state of real estate in Jefferson County, Washington. And... Um, if we, if we look as close as Kitsap County, which is a, about a 45-minute drive from us, as well as you look at the big counties in Washington State like King County, Pierce County, and Snohomish County, they've actually started to see multiple offers and uh, even some escalation clauses, which is um, offer to beat the, uh, an addendum to beat the highest offer. And it's, However, they are still seeing... Uh, prices continue to decline as we are as well. So there is no better time to buy real estate than now. And now for kind of the state of um, real estate in Jefferson County and Port Townsend area. We are continuing to see prices decline. However, the market seems to be picking up. We are seeing offers being made and accepted on more expensive properties um, above 500,000. We haven't seen much of that in the last couple of years, so that's very encouraging. And now just uh, my predictions for 2012. Uh, we will continue to see an increase in short sales and uh, REO foreclosure properties. Um, we have been at Remax First, we've been very successful in the short sale process. Almost every one that, that we've worked on has been uh, successfully closed, so that's been very encouraging. We do see prices continue to fall, and uh, um, if the cycle holds true as a four-year cycle, we, um, we're two to two and a half years into that cycle, and we'll certainly see prices continue to go down this year and probably into 2013 before we start seeing a appreciation again probably in 2014. Um, home sales we do feel are going to increase both in Port Townsend and Jefferson County this year. The first couple of months we've seen a nice um, flurry of activities actually since November and that's continuing into the into the first quarter and we expect that to continue for the whole year. We do see land sales um, as uh, increasing However, uh, they were very dismal in the last couple of years, but um, hopefully we'll see some new housing starts uh, as well uh, from the land sales. Uh, and we're also seeing lenders that are more willing to lend money. So that's kind of my synopsis. Again, it's been a four-year cycle, um, and uh, Jefferson County, Port Townsend, we're two to two and a half years into the cycle. Uh, we are seeing, uh, if you look at us in comparison with the Seattle King County market, we're typically 12 to 18 months behind them. And so there is light at the end of the tunnel. It hit us late. We were actually hoping that maybe it would bypass us, but we're not that fortunate. And uh, so it is affecting us, however, later than uh, the western part of Washington. And we expect that to continue. Uh, with declining prices, but increase in sales through for the 2012 year. Thank you.